The region of Waterloo International Airport could be at risk of losing one of its charter flights in the near future. Arctic Charter Noliner had its flight start just last fall. But noise complaints from local residents have skyrocketed, prompting an airport noise committee to be created. If the airport does lose another charter flight, it could come as a heavy blow, as they've recently lost bearskin flights to Ottawa, which will end up costing them nearly $400,000 annually. Airport General Manager Chris Wood feels the steps currently being taken will keep Nolanor from leaving. Well, we've been working with Nolanor Airlines uh, and their client um, on uh, a compromise to some of the, the concerns that some of the residents have. Um, we believe we've come up with one that um, they're working through their logistics of, of making the change from, from 6 a.m. to 7 a.m. Nicholas Adamick, a student at Conestoga College studying aviation, expresses his concern about how it could affect the future job market. But with Bearskin leaving, um, that's kind of your starting position in the airlines. It's your typical airplane that you start on. So with them leaving as well as Nolan, Nolan or uh, leaving, it kind of creates like a gap in the industry. The committee has indicated they would consider a Cambridge flight path instead, but a formal decision will not happen until next June. For Spoke TV, I'm Steve Rzinski.